All right. Uh, welcome to Electrostatics Demos. I'm going to have a few videos here. I've come into school isolated as it, as it is. This is with electroscopes. I think it'll help out a little bit. So electroscope is a metal ball up here. It is a metal rod and two very fine metal leaves. And those leaves are really light. I've also got a plastic rod, so it's an insulator, and bunny fur to rub against it. And so that'll cause the plastic rod to get charged. So right now, I'm going to back off a little bit. Actually, I'm an idiot. Move that a little bit. Okay. Um, no charge on this rod. So when I rub it and charge it up, and I put it on here in touch, even though it's very wet out today, woohoo! Those leaves spread apart. So they've both got the same type of charge on them. Now, the problem right now, the reason they're a little bit different, ooh, is that this is a crappy electroscope. But notice when the rod gets in, which has the same type of charge, it repels those as well. If I want to discharge this, I'll come in with my hand because my feet are on the ground, I can ground it, and they go back down, which is kind of nice. The next thing is if I charge it up again, I bring the rod close but not touching the electroscope. I want you to predict what would happen there. So I'm going to move that a little bit higher up. And think about what would happen to the leaves. Okay, so I'm going to bring it close. Ooh, away, close, away, close, away. If I touch it, and I've transferred charges again, and the leaves go apart. So basically, it's like they're dancing. That's so fun. Um, basically, what's ending up happening there is when I touch it, that's charging by conduction, where we end up having direct transfer of charge. So even though this is an insulator, once it touches the metal, the metal and the leaves are conductors, and those end up, uh, the charge spreads out as far as it can on them. That's why the leaves spread apart. When I bring this close to the top, but not touching, and I touch there again, um, what ends up happening is um, the neutral electroscope, if this rod is, say, positively charged, the electroscope is neutral, has billions of positives and negatives, the negatives move up toward the top, the positives move toward the bottom. So at least temporarily, the leaves spread apart a little bit. And then when I move the rod away, the leaves go back together a little bit. Now here it wasn't really charged up, so you didn't see that very much. It's only happening a little bit. And that's the idea.